Alright guys, this is take two, just shot a full one and uh, yeah, didn't turn the camera on. Good one. This is Audio Labs DC block. Now, I'm not a huge Foo fan. Whether this could be classed as Foo, I know, you know, cleaning your electrical system and just power purification is a, is a big deal. A lot of people do it. A lot of people spend an awful lot of money doing it as well. Little experience I had with this product about six weeks ago, the guys from Audio Lab came down, they bought the product, have a listen to it, see what you think, a no pressure kind of thing. Uh, and I always like to hear new stuff and get some experience with it. So um, yeah, he came in, we were listening to Hegel H590 Contour 60i, um, and I was airplay to that, probably a thousand pounds worth of cable. So around about the sort of 18 to 20,000 pound mark uh, all in. The difference this piece of kit made to that system was to, to me was just, it was a little bit mind bending. Sounds weird, uh, it, it's not sales nonsense. Like it, it's genuinely made such a large difference that uh, I asked him if I could keep it for a little while. He said no, unfortunately, but I because I didn't really believe the difference that it made because it was so large. I, I didn't want to be tricked by a, a huge sidestep or something like that. I wanted to kind of analyze it and, you know, which isn't really anything about the enjoyment of music, but it, it, it just gives me a, a scope as to with it, without it, what's the difference. Now, it, it, it wasn't a sidestep because I've thought about it a lot since and, and the differences were, uh, you know, the width of everything, the depth of everything, the space around everything, just a kind of a definition shift, like the subtleties between a, a sort of a CD and a, and, a, and a very sort of heavy DSD kind of difference, you know, uh, it was large, do you know what I mean? Uh, it's 95 quid. You know, it, it just has no right to change what is already an expensive system in such a way. Now, of course, what it isn't doing is adding to the system. It's not making an expensive amplifier better because it's a, a, a bad design. It's not doing that. It's just cleaning what's going in, you know? So in here we have uh, mains to the upper floor uh, and then we have an extension cable between the ground fed plugs that are along the wall there um, to our system. And they're all on, you know, they're like a purified sort of strip thing, uh, you know, to, to kind of keep it keep it nice. But um, this went in after that, directly before the amplifier, and uh, ridiculous. I've had speakers that have made less of a difference, you know, speaker upgrades or just speaker changes that have made less of a, uh, a sort of sonic difference. It's a no-brainer for me. Uh, like I say, it's not a, it's not a tactic. We don't make tons of money on ninety-five quid products, but you should, you know, get in touch. I don't mind lending you one. You, sh you should see the difference. Um, like I say, I'm not really one for, for foo or, or especially being told something's great. You know, I, I like to, I like to have hands on or ears on experience. Uh, yeah, it's a. Uh, serious little piece of kit this so I'm gonna unbox it for you as you can see none of them are open well, actually this one here let's just let's do this one actually <clears throat> I actually know why this is open because it's uh, we've not put any of these back in the system yet because I'm midway through a review of five different amplifiers and I, I don't want to change anything else other than the amplifier itself so uh, I can't add them in just yet but I will do um, right, first things first, hopefully you can see the box, booklet, tells you where you plug it in and, and, and where you plug that in, it's quite self explanatory when you see the box, and when I opened the first one, the one that they brought over for us, I was, I was quite happy with this, I love these new satin bags, I hope they're sort of much lower in plastic and stuff like that. They seem like a very recyclable product. Yeah. But they feel lovely as well. That's it. It's a, it's a, you know, it's a little box. Not necessarily heavy, not light, but a 0.7 of a kilo, I think. There's the, uh, the back, input, wall, 
to here and then here to your amp or your CD player or your streamer or you put one in front of each one. Now, I don't know what would happen if you had one in front of everything that you use in your system. Does it get that different every single time you change it? Does it upgrade it by that much? And <laughs> I, 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 I can't even say I doubt it because I doubted it at first. I doubted it would do what was told to me that it would do. Um, but if you add one of them in front of a chain of, say, a streamer, a DAC, and then an amplifier, and then, say, dual monos or something like that, I don't think it's going to have five times the difference. I don't think it can. It sounds like the best thing in the world. So, yeah, that's the product. It's 95 quid. There's a link down there, or there's one here, and I will happily listen to music with you, take this out, put it in, and show you the differences that this box made because unless there was something solid gold inside the demo one and this one's different it'll have exactly the same impact which uh you know these ears have heard a lot you know and uh not many differences like that that you can genuinely tell is a big forward step 95 quid what a result yeah, I'm pretty sure that's it. We've got we should have a little cable in here somewhere. So that's the box there. Then you've got that double ender. Hey. And then that plug to the wall, plug to the box. Just for those of you out there that may want to see it. Wall, product, sucking up all the DC, there's a DC hoover inside there and it only lets AC through, it's an AC pass filter. And then this, female, onto there, off to your product. So that's the direction of flow, like that. Wicked piece of kit. I'm Carl, this is Studio In Car. Everything's down there. If you do get one, get it from us, and then let me know what you think about it. All right? Take it easy, guys.